right you guys welcome back to my channel this is shay and i'm just here with a quick very very quick word of encouragement okay for those who know jesus and for those who do not know jesus okay so for those who know jesus okay i just want you to keep in mind in the book of psalms it says that let your will be done on earth as it is in heaven and guess what we have to read the we have to read the Bible through the lens of wisdom. That is not for everybody, okay? That is for Christians. That is for people who trust and know and know beyond a shadow of a doubt that they are saved through Jesus Christ and that the Holy Spirit lives within them. Guess what? It says that because in heaven, there is no sickness. Sickness will not dwell near. It will not come near. Anyone who has the Holy Spirit, the only people that fear the coronavirus are people who say they know Jesus, but they don't know him. They don't know what's going on, okay? And for those of you who do not know Jesus and you are on this page, this is for you. He says, this is your time. This is your opportunity to seek his face. He put the whole world on pause because right now in this very sacred moment, he is speaking to his people, the ones who are really called by his name, the ones who don't seek validation and things from men but they seek him in their quiet place okay this is listen go seek the lord sit in your car say lord here i am here i am lord i repent i love you teach me your ways clean me fix me up and god is saying listen i've been waiting for you to say that this whole time but because i didn't have a people that had ears to hear heavens were shut up from those who wanted to hear from me because their leaders the people in leadership blocked your blessings that's in the word that's in the word of god it says that the leaders shut up heaven against the, the sheep of god because of their disobedience, because of their will, their lack of knowledge. This is a very sacred moment. Take it not lightly. This is not something to play around with. The Lord is speaking. He shut everything down, okay? And people are dying every single day, and yet you're still here. You're breathing. You're living. You're under the sound of my voice. And that, and, and that enough is enough to say, Lord, save me. Save me, Lord. Wrap your loving arms around me. Teach me who you really are. I don't want to know the Jesus that these people preach. If you say you're real, take him at his word. That's what I did. I said, listen, Lord, if you're real, then I want to know you for real. I don't want to go off of what somebody told me. I want to know you. If you said that I can do this, then I'll do it. If you said that I could be this, then I'll be it. If you say you are who you say you are, keep me, guide me, protect me, and teach me. That is what the Lord is saying in this moment. This is so sacred. It's not to be taken lightly, okay? So God bless you. This moment right here, this is for you. May the blood of Jesus cover you. The Holy Spirit dwell on the inside of you. Unsaved people, this is for you. Saved people, this is for you. Listen to what the Lord is saying. The Lord wants to hear from you. He wants to hear from his people who are called by his name saved and unsaved listen just because you're unsaved in this moment doesn't mean that tomorrow today whenever the lord meets you you have an appointed time where the lord is going to visit you so let it be now let it be now rather than later don't let you get sick with coronavirus for you to say oh lord here i am don't do that don't be a rebellious people the lord wants to hear from you i love you god bless you and i'll be back with another video for you guys